Well, I'm just going to show some of the albums that I found now when I'm up in northern Sweden. Uh, of course, today I bought this 67 Purple Fishes. I haven't opened it yet. I will do so, so when I get home, when I get a good record player and I will enjoy it. Uh, but I went to one of my uh, favorite places here when it comes to record stores. It's one, of, well, probably the only real record store in in Luleå, it's called Café Musica, uh, and I bought some records there. This is one of them. It's David Byrne, oh, oh. and uh, this is a record that I bought on CD back many years ago. And I always use this record when I want to test CD players because it's such a dynamic sound, uh, and uh, also good to test. Uh, um, receivers or uh, stuff like that. So now I bought it on LP as well, right? Uh, oh, bottleneck guitar trendsetters of the 1930s. Side one, Casey Bill Weldon. Side two, Kokomo Arnold. It's on the Yasuo label, as you can see. And we got another um, uh, s uh, cover sleeve illustration by Robert Crumb, who I talked about earlier in this channel. Okay, so then some dance music. Uh, Larry Clinton and his orchestra fe featuring Be Away, 1937 to 1938. Uh, designed for dancing on the Bandstand Records label. Quite cheap, interesting music from the 78 RPM era. Here's another one in the same series, Bob Chester and his orchestra, also on Bandstand Records. Uh, 16 performances never before on LP. Then we have a double album on, on MRC, Mercury, Dino Washington, The Jazz Sides. If you hear a cat meowing, it's my mother's cat. Somebody, it was Lazarus who talked about Tomita. So I found a Tomita album today, Cosmos, and I listened to it and I have to say I love it. I, want, I, I have to try to find more records by Tomita. I've never heard about him before uh, I saw records uh, made by him in the Lazarus uh, video. But now I will check out more of them. Yeah, I found another L uh, album by the Kletzmerim. It's Kletzmer music from uh, it's American Kletzmer music, uh, and uh, I bought this. Of course, I was very happy, and I listened to it. And I always get very happy while listening to the Kletzmerim. Okay, some great Dutch pop rock, Shocking Blue, Ink Pot. This is this is a group that I like more and more. The more I hear of them, great group, great singer in Mariska. Uh, Veris, I think her name is, and uh, have to find more of these. Okay, uh, I will probably do another record uh, shopping hunt, record hunt uh, in the beginning of next week together with my friend Andreas. Uh, but uh, this is what I've found so far. Also, I found around 35. Uh, 78 RPMs, but I will talk about them in another video later ahead, right? Bye-bye.